back to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make a classical Moroccan cookie called Kab al Ghazal, which means ankle of the gazelle. As its name implies, Kab al Ghazal is shaped like an ankle. It's a very soft and buttery cookie that's filled with an almond paste. flour, 1 cup of water, 5 tablespoons of butter, a pinch of salt, 1 egg, and 2 tablespoons of blossom water. Two and a half cups of blanched almonds. If you don't have blanched almonds, you can put normal raw almonds in boiling water for 45 seconds, then peel the skin off. 3 quarters of a cup of sugar, a quarter of a teaspoon of cinnamon, 3 tablespoons of butter, and 2 tablespoons of blossom water. This dough requires a lot of kneading, 20 to 30 minutes approximately by hand. Alternatively, you can use a food processor that have a special kneading head. As you can see, you will get a dough that's very smooth and very elastic. Roast the almonds for a couple of minutes to enhance their flavor. To create the Kahab Lagzel, we're going to spread the dough in a very thin layer, then put to the marzipan, which is the almond paste in the dough, and cover it. Notice how the dough is thin. Shape the cookie on a crescent. Use a wavy cookie cutter to cut cabre lazal. parchment paper on a baking pan and place your cookies on it.
Make tiny holes in the cookie so it doesn't puff up when it bakes. Preheat your oven at 350 degrees. Bake your cookies for 15 to 20 minutes. Make sure you don't keep them too long in the oven, otherwise they'll become very hard. Bon appétit!